welcome back to another vlog today is saturday it is april 6th and y'all gonna see this video tomorrow it's crazy because i've been procrastinating all week to vlog i've been busy all week y'all so today is the day that i'm finally able to do some stuff so i just want to go ahead and open the vlog up because yeah it's gonna be a pretty good weekend so i want this video to be like a spend a weekend with me i should have started yesterday but i didn't do nothing like i literally just sat on the couch and laid there until like seven o'clock like no energy i'm done you're done you're done <laughs> and so i want to start the video off with opening these packages over here y'all we got some stuff some people gifted us some amazing gifts and it's only because of y'all support like if it wasn't for y'all supporting me i wouldn't have gotten this stuff so i just wanted to open it up and show y'all we're gonna see it together because i haven't opened it yet so yeah let's get into it this we have a paid actor today y'all he would you like to say anything would you would you like to say anything to the camera okay y'all i guess that me know Thank you, DLA, for sponsoring this portion of the video. You guys, I wanted to find some great accent chairs for a different section to my living room. So I went onto their website and found that they have eight different colors and four different textures that you can choose from. So I picked the black bone clay. And as you can see, that these chairs are already assembled. You don't need a toolbox. You don't need a hammer. You don't need anything, guys. Straight out of the box, they are ready to go. So... I popped them out of the plastic and I went ahead and started decorating them because you can't find chairs like this this good of a quality and you don't have to assemble. So I felt like these were perfect. These are actually the Dove dining room chairs. So I went ahead and paired them with some pillows that I already had to add more texture to the living room as I said. So yeah, if you're looking for some dining room chairs or any chairs that you're looking for for accent, make sure you check out Daya Lane. They are on their website www.dayalane.com. And y'all, get into this texture. It looks so good into my living room, and it fit the space perfect. I could not have picked a better chair. So thank you, Daylane, for sponsoring this portion of the video. Y'all, so my granddaddy just came to cut my grass. My boyfriend was already going to get us a lawnmower for my house, but my granddad was like, I'm just going to come over there and do it today. So that's what we have to do. We got to cut the grass, and he just, weeded, he just did the weeded on the backyard. And now he's cutting the grass on the front. So he asked me, do I want to ride and like cut the grass? I'm like... Yeah, I might as well just do it so I can learn how to cut my own grass. So yeah, spring is here, summertime is coming. You gotta cut this grass if you own a house, y'all. It's gonna be expensive to pay somebody. Gonna pay for somebody like $60, $60, $70 to cut grass. You know, grass grow every two weeks. That's too much money. So my granddad here finna teach me the tea. And yeah. Still rocking my money and bait. Sit back and roll on eighth. Smoking that shit to the face. I call a cool different race. Skate on the car, hit the gate. Ain't seeing no slam of the day. I'm clever if you come from the A. Strip breaking off, we ain't waiting. Strutting off in the vest lane. Smoke on back to the brain. Sliding that bend and move same. 2018, the new range. Don't do that shit, ease the pain. Take you and sip for a pain. We're going sack on these saints. Doing that shit that you can't Keep on your bitch like a saint I'm trying to think I'm alright I'm about to blow like a tank Wire that shit to the bank How much you want for that rate? Couldn't make four inches and I'm finna skate Roll these cars right out the face Get in the mess out of the street Okay y'all, so my green daddy um, just left from cutting my grass And me and my grandma was cleaning inside the house I didn't vlog much of it because it was chaotic We um we had like a deep fryer that we dropped and the oil came out so we had to clean all that up but anyways i wanted to show y'all some stuff that i got from amazon amazon actually sent me this as a housewarming gift we were on twitter and i said something about like i just ordered some wallpaper from my office for amazon and so they were like hey thank you for shopping you know send me your wish list if you have one we can get you some stuff so I made like a, I already had like a list together because I, you know, I just bought a house, so I had a house from the list ready. So um, I, they picked these off my list, some mittens, and they are like rib and silicone. I love these; they feel so good. And they got me some cast iron skillets. Oh my god! Like when you get cast iron skillets, like you're officially an adult. Like. Only adults have these. Only adults know how to cook in them. Only adults know how to clean them. Like, 
because you don't wash these like a regular dish. You don't put them in a the dishwasher. You gotta take care of these because this this is some good stuff. So yeah, I thought that was so sweet. And they sent me a letter. It said. This is the letter they sent me. They said, we hope that these give bring you so much pleasure. We appreciate you for hanging out with us on social media, delivering smiles from Amazon's social media team. I'm so excited, y'all. So yeah, um, all this, um, all of these are gonna be leaked down below in my description box in my Amazon storefront, along with my bar stools. What else I got from Amazon? All my, basically a lot of stuff I got from my house gonna be on my Amazon storefront because I got it from Amazon. So make sure y'all check the description box for that. And I got a gift. My boyfriend bought me a new purse. And if you know, you know, if you know, you know. <laughs> so this is the Glamaholic Lifestyle. Y'all, I really, I always love vanity bags. I never had one, but this one is so tiny, like, it's still cute though because so yeah this is what i got in here so far some lip gloss a twist tie and my cards so yeah i'm gonna wear this today because i'm a girl that ain't never had nothing I ain't used to nothing so i'm gonna wear it today but i'm about to get dressed because it's like two o'clock now i'm about to get dressed and i'm gonna hang out with my mom and my sister today so i'm gonna bring y'all along and that's about it oh and i'm going bowling tonight so yeah I probably look so crazy because I haven't done nothing to my hair. I'm going on vacation, not this Monday coming up, but the next one I'm going out of town. So after the trip, these braids coming down. Like I love them, but you know how you get braids and like you just, you, you want some bundles again. And then when you get bundles, you want braids. And then when you get your silk press, you want braids and bundles. It's just like the life of being a girl basically so crazy so yeah i'm about to go put some clothes on and i'll check on y'all when we get in the car get in loser we're going shopping <laughs> i just made it to um ross and tj maxx so my mom wants to come up here to the store it's closer to my house so that's what we're doing and then we're gonna go to hibachi a little bit later so I don't think I brought y'all in Ross the last time I came. They didn't really have much, but hopefully they have some today. So we got a Ross, TJ Maxx, um, and Hobby Lobby that we're about to go in. So let's go ahead and meet up with them. They in Ross right now, so I'm a little late. Let's just go and meet up with them. And let's see what we can find. I might get that. How much look. is it? Let's see. Oh, $7.99. How much what is that? $8.99. Mine is $11.99. Let's see. This one is really pretty. Ew. Move. That's so cute. Okay, y'all, so I have finished shopping with my sister and my mama. I didn't find anything. I guess it's because I wasn't looking for nothing in particular. Like, I just couldn't find anything that I wanted. So, yeah. Um, Right now, I'm at the bowling alley with my boyfriend and his family. So, they come often. And tonight, they are very competitive. I'm going to say that. So, I don't know if I'm going to bowl. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to bowl because yeah i don't know how to bowl for real i'm bowling for fun they bowling for scores so yeah i just wanted to open the vlog well i just wanted to check in with y'all because we're about to go bowling i need a car that don't decline every day's a party all my brothers and my choppers and my charging smoke and we're still the same ain't nothing changing since the car we don't get angry we don't get even we don't talk about beef by the way that I mentioned I just turned vegan I need the pagans breathing so they can see my new top boy season I need the pagans alive so they can all see that it's still my time I don't know why they act tough online I see them outside and they ain't say nada Soon as you say on site we looking for you like some vintage Prada Looking for you like some archive pieces Jealousy in the ends They hate when you become successful but in the trenches we were all friends How long we trying to pretend I know they love to see me do well 
money or is it about girls? Either way, I'm threatening men. See, just text it diligent, yeah. Good morning, y'all. It is the next day. It is Sunday, and I'm about to get ready to go to church, but I just wanted to open up the video because after church, I'm gonna go to the grocery store because I told y'all I'm in charge of Sunday dinner again. So I think I told y'all already, but I'm not really sure. But me and my boyfriend started this thing where we're gonna cook Sunday dinner every Sunday. Like, even if it's like something small, but we're gonna eat together every Sunday. And so that's what I'm gonna do today. And I really don't have any other plans for real. Y'all, we had so much fun last night. Like, my voice is barely making it. Like, I was screaming all last night because I'm, I guess I'm kind of competitive too. Like, when we was bowling, I was having a good time. And I know how to bowl now. Like, I won three out of four games. Granted, his little cousin, um, she's like 12 or 13. She was playing with the guardrails up, so like she won like the third one, but it don't, that don't count. Like all her balls were going to the gutter. She didn't have the things in there. No shade to Brooke, no shade to Brooke. But yes, like I won three out of four games. That's pretty good. My boyfriend on the other hand, yeah, I don't know what he had going on, like with his skills with it last night, but he still had the overall highest score, but he didn't win like any they y'all we played like five games we were there from like eight to twelve somebody every time you look up they was like adding more time to the freaking games i don't know where this time was coming from but it was like at an hour at an hour at a, we was there for so long but we had so much fun had so much food it was just fun you hang up he talked his ass i'm so weak so yeah, we're about to get ready to go to church and we might finally touch that lunch room, y'all. I've i been, I've been cleaning it as I go, but at the same time, it's like I've been washing clothes, putting clothes on top of the dryer, not folding them up. And it's just, yeah. And I'm, as I'm saying it, I'm remembering yesterday when I was looking for a shirt, I took all these clothes out the basket and just put them on the floor. And it's a mess. Like, I need to go ahead and get my closets built out so I can have somewhere to put my clothes. Because right now, I don't have anywhere. Like, even if I was to fold my clothes, they were all, like, going on the top shelf of my closet. Which is, I can do that. But it's no organization. It just looks crazy. And my yard looks so good. I'm looking at that now. My yard looks so good from my granddaddy cut my grass, y'all. That's the part of home ownership that they don't tell you about. No, the HOA do not pay your, they don't cut your grass. HOA is not for that. You have to cut your own grass. So before people run out and buy a house, mind you, you have to cut the grass. Like, granted, I have my boyfriend and my granddad that's going to come out here and do it for me. But still, like, that's a lot of work. Granted, my yard is not that big. It's big enough. So, yeah, it's a lot of work. And I'm still looking at my chairs over there, y'all. I love the chairs. I think it looks so good. I was kind of worried that it's going to be, like, too cluttered. But, yeah, I, I'm, I'm thinking the chairs are going to stay. I, I was going to put them in my office, but I think they're going to stay. And then we went on the Amazon order today. Let me see where it is. Because we got some wallpaper coming in for the office. Um, I think it's going to be here today. And, y'all, I'm down to look at my nails missing 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 like what i woke up this morning and this one gone like i don't even know how that happened like yeah okay let's see if it's out for delivery because last time i know i had a package on my doorstep at freaking 10 o'clock in the morning 
Okay, just arrived to the post office, so I might be getting it soon. We'll see, because I want to put that up probably tomorrow, because it's going to go in the next video, because I'm doing my office, because I got a desk and all that stuff. So, yeah, let's just go ahead and go upstairs. It's 9.30. The church started at 11. And I'll talk to y'all later. And if y'all follow Taja, she did this in her living room. She used the wallpaper too. So I'm going to do this in the office. And we're going to see how that goes. So that's going to be in the next video. But I'm about to go ahead and cook dinner. Because I ended up, when I on my way to the store, I changed my mind of having like meatloaf and mashed potatoes with broccolini. Y'all, we about to have meatloaf, candy yams, cabbage, and fried corn. Because... Why not? Like, I don't want to just eat mashed potatoes with the um, Milo. But I got these two. I love these. My favorite. I love these. So it was between the red lobster biscuits, the Jiffy honey butter cornbread, or like making actual cornbread. I don't have time for that. It's already 123. And y'all know how long it takes. So I'm going to go ahead and prep this stuff for the Milo. And everything else is not going to take long at all. So... I'm to the point now, I need to start prepping Sunday dinner on Saturday. So when I leave from church, I can just throw it in the oven or whatever. Because this is a lot of work. It's going to be a busy Sunday. I love to chill on Sundays, y'all. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm just as cold as water. Cold. I'm just as cold as water. Cold. I'm trying to own the boy. Own the boy. I'm just as cold as water. Bring out the rest of my bed. Bed it. Still shooting dice at the palace. Palace. I'm coming cooking with gadgets. And kind of he still living left. I treat these little hoes like some maggots They stick to the kid like a man. And suck up on me, call me daddy Shluffin', so I never forget it She probably didn't know she was with it That shit drip from my mouth to the tips Had to move cause she fucked the whole city I'm just down and that shit ain't gon' be lit You a hater, why won't you admit it? You a smash up with personal business When the verse is gon' cost you some bitches Oh, 
Okay guys, so that wraps up this video. I am done cooking Sunday dinner. I am done eating. Now I'm about to clean up and get ready for next week's vlog. I'm gonna start vlogging tomorrow. And yeah, that's about it. So make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know down below if y'all like these weekend vlogs or do y'all wanna stick to the home decor. Just let me know what y'all wanna do. And I guess that's it. I'll talk to y'all next week. Bye.